Beretta, 1915. Weighing in at 1.9 pounds with an overall length of 6.7 inches, this blowback-operated handgun was made just in time to replace Italy's problematic pistol, the Glacinti. Wedging in past that stiff heel release, we pop in our 7 rounds of 9x19mm, but these are not parabellum. The slide pole gets heavier as you go thanks to that buffer spring. Glad we have the serrations to pinch. The grip is surprisingly thick for a single-stack magazine, and that trigger? Short pull, but boy is it mushy. At least the sights are taller than what I'm used to on these World War I semi-autos. The two safety setup is strange. The one on the rear blocks the hammer, while the other blocks the trigger. Feels a bit redundant, and both require me to break my grip. Recoil is okay thanks to that heft, and she locks open when empty. Nice. Overall, not a bad sub-in, I'd say. Just wish that cartridge was a little more powerful. If you'd like to know more, subscribe to see an arsenal.